Greetings Lunarians, welcome back to the channel, I am your host, Vago Sonari. How's everybody doing today? We are back with more Norgard, baby. It's time to make some changes. So, anybody who was here for the last couple of streams knows that I lost um, my progress in one of my streams. I think it was like, what was it, episode 8, I think I lost my progress. So, uh, yes, this should have been episode 10 today, but, you know, stuff happens, you know? Spider, what's up, buddy? How you doing? My day's going great. It's going great. So, it's been a, quite a busy day, actually, of working and teaching a lot of music, but got some good progress done with my students today, but it's time to relax. So, all right. Um, the new plan is to go to the um, go to the east in Leonia's region. So, I need to go down here and try to pincer them off. Hopefully, um, we can make some good momentum down this way with Vanner's team. So, I, uh, I made the momentum I wanted to down this way, and I was trying to see if I could, you know, finagle my way out of this spot, but I really can't because it's just, it's connected too much to too many different things. So, the most I can do over here is going down towards Orkney, and then Camelford, and that's pretty much it. So, hopefully I can get this one back, we'll see. Um, did I even capture that yet? I don't think I've even attacked from this area, I forget. But in any case, this is the new plan to try to go down and uh, take over Leonia's uh, country. So, all right, we are in the organized phase. I think I'm actually done with the organize because I think I actually prepared before we got um, on uh, to the episode today. So, at the capital though, we do have knights waiting to come out here. I need to get Shootless done and bring him over to somebody's team if they need it. Um, hang on, let me check the teams really quick. I can probably wait for it, to be honest. So, Winglin, Luintel, and Zerifin is a new team. So, they're going to be new. There's going to be more heals here. So, Gingling has a heal. Um, Zerifin should have a heal. And then, uh, you will have a heal. Um, honestly, I think I need to change him back over to a cleric. I don't think he's done with the cleric. Hang on. It depends. It, it highly depends on who's here. <laughs> okay, well, they're going to reinforce this no matter what, but still, yeah. Alright, um, but with what is the question? Didn't they attack me from Lydney not too long ago? I can't remember, so. Seath, how you doing today, buddy? Good to see you. Welcome to the stream. It's a good day for Brigandine, man. Alright, can everybody hear me okay? Because my mic levels have been weird recently. Hopefully there's no distortion or, like, no cutting. So let me know if you can hear me okay, please. That would be much appreciated. Alright, this team is... This team is decent. Um, I guess I could reinforce it with more knights. And replace one of these guys, maybe. I'm not sure. They're decent, I just don't like Kirkmon's rune area. It's terrible. Um, Scorpion can fit right there. Hang on. Let me see. 497. 497. Let's reorganize this slightly. Uh, that's... No. Crap, it doesn't work. 35? Okay, 35 can go. You go up this way. That's full. Alright, excellent. Oh, you're playing Leonia right now? Awesome. Who's your main team on Leonia? Do you have, like, a couple of main teams right now? My main team, like almost every single time, was either uh, it, it, Kiloff was was on the on the team. Um, but my main team for Leonia was always Kiloff, Paternus, and Isfis, or Charlene. I would bounce back and forth between those two, but it would always be Kiloff and Paternus on the same team. So sometimes Azmit, if I could level him up quickly. But yeah, Paternus just carries a lot. One more day till your PC, man. Is that correct? How's it going, buddy? Good to see Wild Mike in the stream today. Did you stream earlier? I didn't see you go live. Uh, 35, 40, uh, it's gonna hold 5th, it's gonna hold 25. That's full, okay? This can hold up to 40, so another unicorn. So not quite the clay going. But another unicorn can be here. I can't fit one, but uh, we'll get something. 
Oh, you're talking to your girl? Cool. Cool. Priorities, man. Priorities. Yeah, dude, please. I would love to see some more FF12. I, I'm just like, I'm a fanboy, so I mean, if you play FF12, I'm going to watch the entire thing. But, uh, yeah. So. Uh, Lizard. It's fine. It's close enough. Alright, this should be good order here. Not too shabby. Awesome. Alright. Now for the castle. Um, or the capital, rather. What can I summon here with the mana I have left? Probably anything, really. I could summon a giant. How much can you carry? You can carry more, obviously. I definitely want to put you on a team at some point. Um, let's see. You can carry 75 more. Um, if I put this here, you can carry 100 more. Hmm. Alright, cool. Yeah, dude, I'm totally down to play some more Bro Force. I love it. I absolutely love it. So, um, what to do? What to do? I guess I can start preparing for Cortina. Um, let's see. I can summon a dragon for Shulius and he would be done, but that's only three monsters. He needs some more support. Um, he has a dragon, he has a lizard. Or he has a giant, he has a lizard guard. Let's give him at least a djinn, I think. Um, or a Fenrir. I can't think. Um, Cortina, Kirkmont, and Sophia was your main team? Wow. You definitely put your time in building those characters, that's for sure. So. But it works out, though, because the lower level your knights are, the better they're going to be at level 30, you know. So. Um. Sure. Mm. And let's start Cortina with the gin. Why not? So, two gins. Alright. They're almost there. <laughs> they're getting there. Um. Did I get any gear? Off screen. I got some stuff. Holy armor, poison fang, maiden spear. That's going to uh, Faticia. Hmm. Slay the spire. That that sounds familiar. Is it on Steam? Is that a, a, is that a Steam exclusive game? I've heard the title. I have no clue what the gameplay is, but I've heard the title before. Alright, so the Maiden Spear going to Faticia, where is she? Is she questing right now? She probably is. No, nobody's questing. Alright, that's going to you for sure. Holy armor. Um, Blue and Tail? Possibly. That would help. If he doesn't have anything already. Nope. This is perfect for you. Boom. Let's see. Oh, Elementalist is the, um, is the sorcerer. It's, uh, after the mage class, the green, you evolve it into a sorcerer in the original version, you know. This is the same one. So, yeah. It's where you choose between uh, the Sorcerer and the Druid. So, they just renamed it Elementalist. Or Elementist for short. They can't fit all the characters in there. Yep, that's correct. That is correct. That team's looking pretty, man. I like the look of it. No items. Uh, we have Poison Fangs. Give it to one of the main team. Let's see. Um, good. Calming Bell we can save until later, until we actually need it. Um, currently we do not. So, Alright. Let's uh, make sure we're questing who we need to quest. Who's going to be standing here for defense? 
Evade, Palamese, and Morhold. Decent. They've got some really tanky units and a sorcerer. They just don't have too much heals though. Morhold's a healer, and Evane's a healer, slightly. But then again, I can't use a lot of nuking power if I um, don't have other heals. But uh, we should be okay for now. Alright, so, quest for Tishia. Um, who's going to be attacking me? <laughs> Could be some crazy stuff attacking me, actually. They're probably going to attack uh, Camel Ford here this next round. Uh, let's see. I'll have to look it back up. I know that it was like, when I was exploring my Steam queue um, of what they thought I would be interested in, that came up. And I probably have it on my wish list. I mean, I have a ton of stuff on my wish list because, let's face it, I like to try a lot of different games. But I mean, yeah, there's, that sounds so familiar. I'll, I'll look it up here after this, for sure. You got, <laughs> you piqued my interest. Um, Alright, let's see. Nobody else is moving. I think we're good to go. So, teams of three. Let's check it. One, two, three, four, five. You two need to quest for right now. I could move Vector somewhere, but it's really not necessary at the time. Okay, so you two need to quest. Alright, so there's three there. Three at List Noise, three at Camel Ford. You're still building, and Jukes is defended as well. Alright, so let's go back to Humber. Get these two on a quest. Questing away, give me good stuff. All right, and go. Attack phase. Here we go. All right, they definitely reinforced these castles. They had to. So yeah, they all moved. Um, it's not too bad. I'm not gonna attack that spot, but like, still, if they attack me, it won't be bad. Uh, this, it's not crazy scary. They do have some nuking power though. Demon, and plus they have Malay with some nice MP. Um, Esmeri is good for support, and so is a few heals, but he can only heal once. Um, I'll probably come in there and attack, actually. Yeah. Let's give that a shot. Alright. Um, who's going to be at me over here? Lance is probably coming in. Garen's probably coming in. And... Melligan's probably coming in, so maybe Gloss, we'll see, they have an angel. Um, yeah, I'm definitely getting hit right here. Let's see, Leonia, what you got over here? Alright, two Arc Seraphs are still here. I need to kill them or capture them, one of the two, they have to go. Um, so yeah, let's try this again. We'll beat them this time because <laughs> we've got a much better team coming at them this time. Alright, one, two, three, go. I think that's it. Alright, let's check. Two attacks only. Jinx, no. Camel Ford, no. Alright, good. Save. Oh, man. How's everybody's day going today? Summer's almost officially here, man. Crazy cool. But not cool. <laughs> it really is not cool. It's very hot. Um, or it's going to get very hot. I really prefer the colder weather over the hot, but it's a good change of pace because it's been absolutely freezing in the winter this year. Alright, let's go. Scalio going at it. They failed. Man, Driss, come on, dude. Don't lose it. Oh, Kai. Andre, welcome back to the stream. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. Alright, so we get our attack first. Maybe they didn't attack me at Camel Ford. I'm not sure. They had the means to. They'd be fooled not to try. <laughs> um. Alright. Andre, how's your day going, buddy? My day's going great today. Good day for Burgundy. A flower that takes years to grow becomes ash in a flash of war. War destroys everything. Why do you want ashes and death? You misunderstand. I work to revive hope from the ashes. Only sorrow comes from the ashes. Don't you see? I do not agree. Hm. Then I must stop you. <laughs> you will try. 
You do have a lot of healing power down there, though, but I got a lot of damage coming your way. So we'll see how this goes. Alright, let's move the slow units first. Think about your position on the way down. It's always a good strategy. Um, yeah, more fronts over here. Let's see. Yep, it's fine. They do have heals for days. Not me. I don't have too much. But I have enough. I have enough. So it's all about balance, bro. Unless you're Leonia, you can just heal your way to victory. So, which is not a bad thing at all, you know. If anything, it makes it one of the easier playthroughs. On an unrelated note, but not completely unrelated note, um, it is a strategy um, game that I just recently started playing. It's it's a classic, like it's an old, old board game from Japan. I think it's from Japan, but it's called Go, G O. But like, uh, it's not the actual meaning Go. I don't believe. And so, um, has anybody played Go before? Let me know because it's really, really fun. But my God, it's it can be very, very tough. Has anybody played Go? Let me know. If you're not sure what that game is, Google it. Google uh, the word "go" and then write "board game" after it. Then you'll you'll find it really easy. It's a black it's a black and white piece like chess, um, and it's on a board that has a whole bunch of different tiles and intersections. The idea is to place your pieces on the intersections of the tiles and try to surround your other your your opponent's pieces so you can capture them. It's very very basic, but it's really fun, and it lasts. It can last a long time depending on who you're playing against. So, oh, Andre, I'm just getting started. Um, this is my first battle today. So this will last for at least an hour, hour and a half tops. So, yeah, you got plenty of time, man. So you came in at the right time. Let's see. Let's just keep you back here. I think it would be interesting to start doing board game streams or board game episodes of some sort, like classic stuff, just for like something casual. I know Indie Sundays are, is pretty casual already, so I kind of already have that going for me, but like, um, I do love my board games, depends on the board game, but uh, yeah, I would like to just implement that just because, you know, it seems interesting. Oh, are you wasting MP? You're putting power on Paternus? I mean, it's good because he can hit hard, but why? I don't think I've ever seen that in my life. I've never seen someone put power on Paternus besides myself. 
at that point he was a ninja. <laughs> It's just spelled G-O. That's it. I thought it was G-O-H because of Japanese, but like it's G-O. So if you Google uh, the word Go, G-O, and then board game, you'll find it. You know, it's a big board filled with tiles with uh, black and white pieces, magnetic pieces. So typically, you know, that's like the modern day version is magne magnetic pieces. So. at this very strangely, but it's decent. I'm trying to get away of both Meteor Dooms. So, you can cast it see, two, three almost immediately. So, if I bring you let's see, one, two, three if you cast it here, reach this area right here. One, two, one, two. So, let me see if I can entice it to actually cast a Meteor Doom. I'll bring it one space in and then you I don't want you getting hit by Meteor Doom. <laughs> I want you get hit by Meteor Doom either. Um, let's see. We'll definitely get hit if I put you there. Let's, let's keep you here. There. That's the Meteor Doom spot. Um, let's see. One, two, three. One, two. Get the angel here. I'm trying to eyeball this the best I can. There. Let's see if they cast it. I don't think they will. Nope. Definitely not. There's only one unit in range. So. <laughs> They're being smart. That's good. Trying to tie some more. One, two, three. They can get two units now. If I bring Vennard in, they'll definitely cast it. If he gets hit by it, it's not going to be the end of the world. Let's try to entice it like this. spot. Stay. Alright, come on. Cast that Meteor Doom. I know you want to. There it is. Good. Okay. He got four. He got four. It's not terrible, though. I'll have to heal up the dragon, but... Alright, here they come. 
Nice block. Excellent job. Alright. Curse this dude into oblivion. <laughs> um, let's see. Can I get some can I get Brangin some experience? Or do I want this for the demon? Um You'll probably hit ten if I kill this Griffin off. Let me see. Excellent shot. Alright. Dragon, what's your percentage? Seventy nine. Lizard's definitely going to be 100. Yep. And then we can kill it with a curse. Yeah, I know. I was looking for it. And then, yeah, don't have any. How close? That's pretty close. Um, dragon. I need something to go here because I want to put um, Roadbull right here. So, yeah, that might work out. Sure. Alright, protection. You. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened to Alteria. I, I saw her upload a video, like, I think a week ago. But only one video, um, I th and I think it was of Terra. I'm pretty sure. But yeah, I haven't heard from Alti in a very long time, so slightly worried about her. <laughs> Hopefully, she's doing okay. Nothing major can get in here and hit Vaynerd. I need to put protection on you, but it's going to be with this pixie. Um, how about you take protection as well? Hakuna's around. Uh, yeah, he was in Discord talking to Mike yesterday. They had a long discussion about something. Um, I think it was of Dynasty Warriors, but... Yeah, he's around. So... If he's online, text him. Get his ass in here. It's time to play. It's done. Yeah, he's a uh, he's a pro, so <laughs> tread carefully. I'm sure there was no hostility, but like, yeah. If you want to hang with the debate, you better be ready for the long haul if you're going to debate him. Yeah. I'm not sure when triggers do back. I think he's due back before this Sunday. I'm not sure. Either, it's either this Sunday or next Sunday. Uh, I can't remember how long they're staying in Island, but uh, yeah. Hopefully they're having a good time, man. I'm excited for him. You can kill that. Go. They don't have much to work with over here, man. Only thing that's keeping them here is probably Paternus and the two Archangels. If they lose one of these guys, they might retreat. We'll see. Hmm. Let's see. Yeah, the dude's not afraid to say what's up, man. Not afraid whatsoever. Uh, let's see. If they're smart, they're gonna go over here. Like, all of them go over here. Hmm. It might be a nice failsafe if I have, like, a nuker here. But then again, this spot is, like, ripe for Divine Ray. Um, 
with so, so are these spots. But we do have a curse. We can relocate her to here. It's not terrible. Um, yeah. Stay with what you're stay with what you're doing. This is fine. I do need to put protection on this dragon at the bottom though. So, boom. Yeah, if, if he hits a dragon, he's gonna do some pretty hefty damage. But hopefully he hits like a protected dragon. That'd be preferable. But the good thing about that is, is I think they plan on like making him come in here and just attacking me in the front line. If he does that, then he's dead. So we'll see how it goes. No, I'm doing great today, man. Like, uh, if I'm in the midst of battle right now, I'm I'm pretty well focused. But like, uh, you know, you can still talk to me. It's not a big deal. So, I'm just uh, just forgive me if I miss a few messages here and there. You know, it's it's bound to happen. It's happened before. But uh, yeah, yeah, I'm doing good, man. Hmm. Let's have you go this way, actually. Um, if I put you here. It's a good feel safe and then put the demon in this slot right here. So, yeah, go there. Good. Alright, any more heals? Banner could probably use one, but I think I'll use the unicorn's last heal for that. So. You excited to get your new PC, man? You said one more day, right? Oh! That's Meteor Doom territory. Scary stuff. We'll see if they protect it well. Not really. I <laughs> can hit it with a lot of stuff. That's unfortunate. <laughs> okay. Alright. Um, we can still get it. Yeah, we can still get it. Okay. This griffin might die in the process, though. <laughs> so I want to breath down, breath this way, get him with a divine ray, and that should be it. Possibly. We'll see. Um, centaur's available. Can you hit and run? Mm. I don't think I can. If I go in here, it's going to be adjacent to three different monsters. That's not good. So yeah, just do tiny hits here. No, just stay back. There we go. Um, you... I want the demon to go here. But then again, you're in curse range of this guy. Let's see. So I could just put the centaur here, get a free shot. Hopefully hit. Heels. Banner. Yep. Gotta do it. It's dead. What am I thinking? Like, I can hit it with a frost. It doesn't stand a chance. I got it. Alright, so... Maybe... Maybe a Geno? How does it look? It's decent. It's not terrible. They're not going to stick around for a while. Let's see. Sure. Ouch. That hurt. Alright, let's do the acid breath. Down this way, possibly. Um, hang on. Can I do it without hitting my griffin? Because I can use this for acid breath right here. That might do like 90 something. I can use a venom from here. It'll do a decent amount of damage because it's white. Black and white. Um, let's see. That's good news, man. Good. Let me know when you get that. Um, Brangian has a snipe shot on you. 
and Vayner has a Frost. Yeah, I shouldn't have to breath down this way to just get a decent amount of damage. So, I should have plenty. I want to curse this thing, though. Ah, oh, man, I can't decide. No, let's breath down. I'm not taking any chances right now. I need these Arc Seraphs to go away. Just get out of here. I don't want you to get Alright, Spider, we'll see you later, man. Hopefully you can stick around uh, for a longer period on Tuesday. So, you take care of yourself. Sure, might as well. Ooh, kill. Definitely. Good. Alright, um, let's try to get a centaur hit, 85, that's not bad, go, excellent, oh yeah, it's gonna die, easily, alright, so, um, I'm free to curse this thing, I can kill this with the frost easily by doing a breath attack and then frost is dead, so, Let's do um, so the breath attack for sure. Make sure that gets in there. No meteor doom for you. No, sir. I hope it doesn't have a lapis. I didn't even check. Nope, healing ring. Does this one have a lapis? Nope, holy amulet. Hmm. Maybe I'll get to steal both of those. <laughs> that would be cool. Alright, demon. You're probably going to level just from doing this damage. Um, or I could kill the griffin. Uh, no. Focus this guy down. Let's see. So, this will die from a frost. I can use you to attack this Arc Seraph over here and try to get this gone. Um, what's the percentage here? 78. It's not terrible. Um, let's get protection to... I don't know what's worth it. Mm. Let's give protection to the Griffin. Why not? It's level five. If I can save it, I would prefer to. So. in first. I'm not going to be able to kill it, but... Nice damage. Okay. This lizard guy is going to go bye-bye very soon. So, yeah. Nice. Ooh, nice hit. Nice block. Wow. That couldn't have gone better. Oh, Brangian, if I could only do a crit with you, I could kill this thing. Maybe if you crit normally, but... Oh, man, I wish. I wish. But nope. It's a wide attack. Yep. It's dead. That's fine. All right, Vayner, it's time. Oh boy, here we go. All right, uh, let's see. Geno Frost is only gonna get three. It's not worth it. So let's just get a normal Frost and get this thing out of here. Goodbye. And I got the healing ring, nice. All right. Uh, does that room area reach? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, it does. Okay. 
Sailor Planetos, how you doing, buddy? Good to see you. How's your day going? We're just cleaning house today here in Burgundy. Um, you are on whose team? You're on Issa's team. Um, yep. If I'm gonna kill this thing, I gotta kill it now. And hopefully hit. I don't have a hollow. Let's see. Let's give the dragon protection first. Eighty percent. No. Oh. Oh, you jerk. Look at that. I need both of these gone. I need them gone. Ugh. It's disgusting. I should have healed him before I went off. Oh well. Damn it. Ugh. Oh well. At least I got one gone. Yep, there it is. Oh, lame. Really lame. Mm -hmm. Well, at least I didn't get Meteor Doomed. That's good. Oh, you mean trial mode in the uh, in FF12? Nice, dude. Yeah, if you can, like uh, the best grinding to do, in my opinion, like the fastest way, especially like uh, at early stages, uh, is to um, grind from level one to level nine, like beat stage nine. As soon as you get into stage 10, quit and, lo and load up your autosave. So yeah. You do that over and over on like uh, the high speed that they have in the, uh, in, that ga in the game, then yes. You will definitely make bank on your LP, bro. I'm serious. Crazy good. Oh, also, I'm not sure if you found any of them yet, but, like, have you found any of the, um, the golden amulets? If you have a golden amulet, please equip it, because that will double your license points. Now, now I want to play Final Fantasy XII. <laughs> Damn you, Mike. <laughs> Can't you see I'm busy with Brigandine? No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You can find one, um, I'm not sure, well, how far are you right now? Like, what, what's the area that you're in right now? You are 10. Nice. Alright. Let's curse you up. Hopefully get a kill with Granji. Oh, okay. So you're just getting out of Luzu. Um, yeah, you got a ways to go before you get the first one. But as soon as you hit the desert, the, um, the Sand Sea. As soon as you hit the Sand Sea, it's the Ogiriensis Sand Sea. You'll, uh, you'll go up this flight, uh, this ramp up into like the, the towers or whatever 
and then as soon as you get into those towers, you'll find both maps uh, to the sand sea, to, to both sand seas. So the map to the Ogre Yensa and the Nam Yensa right beside each other in those um, those urns, those green urns. And then also you will um, wait one minute. Also you will find the golden amulet in uh, if you look at the map, it's like in a, in a centerpiece tower, like where it has two sides going up and down. So it's like it's, a, it's like a big circle. So you start here, you go up, and then it's right here in the middle part, and then you can go over here and go down. So yeah, it's, it's a little weird to explain, but you know, if you look at your map, you'll find it. So, pretty simple. And if you can't find it, well, I'll help you. <laughs> Level 10 dragon. This team's gonna look pretty. I definitely will give the translator of this game some props for coming up with ridiculous ass names. It definitely is entertaining, but yeah. Um, that does not mean they are not ridiculous in the least. Excellent. All right. So we're almost at an hour. That battle took quite a while. Um, if I have another one, I'll I might fight like a little bit of it, but we'll see. Nah, I'll fight till completion. <laughs> if I have another one. Music's still going, so we'll see. And yep, I knew they would come in here. I knew it. All right, <clears throat> last battle of the night, folks. Let's hash it out. Garrett, Cole, and Adelicia. I don't know. <laughs> it's not going to be pretty. Um, who's going to the castle? Palomides will go in the castle. I'm with you, Evade. Looks like I can't let you have all the credit this time. <laughs> if I can't have all the credit then you'll just have to fight without me. Hey! <laughs> Stick together, buds. Oh, this will be interesting to try to defend. It's going to be a tough one. Alright, um... I need you in the water like pronto. Lots of hydras here, lots of water to make use of, but if I want to put them all in the water, it's going to be a very, very strange formation. Um, so let's put you here at least. Um, yeah, you can go here. You are going to get behind Halloween's, I believe. I prefer to have you here, actually, but... Ah, uh, that cracked my back. Oh my god. That's fun. Woo. Yeah, if anything, I want to make sure that they're at least dead. I mean, capturing them would be really, really cool. But in any case, yeah, they need to die. <laughs> I mean, they're they're low level, but they're still dangerous, just because of the breath attack by itself. You know. Excuse me. Sorry about that, man.
Alright, there's really no good place for you to go in the water. Not out of range of heals anyway. So... Yeah, do that. And then, um, I prefer you to go here. But I can't have what I want always, can I? Um, alright, go here for now. Stay. <sighs> yeah, that should be a rule for me. When I get sick, it's bad. Like, I don't get sick very often at all. But when I do get sick, it's bad. And then it turns out, you know, I'm taking a week off of, you know, streaming and recording and all that stuff. I'm still, you know, recovering from, you know, aftermath and stuff like that and trying to get caught up with my uh, students. Because every time I miss, like, a day of work, um, I have to make up that day. You know, I have to reschedule my students to different appointments and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, being busy with that has kept me from, you know, recording as much as I would like to. So... But, I'm all caught up now, so things should be a lot more regular from now on, I hope. Actually, so keep the hellhound this way. Hmm. How's this gonna pan out? I could go here or here, but you have exit blast available. Yeah, this spot right here and this spot is gonna be your your key points. Okay. Yeah, I'm good with that. Um, move here. Alright, that's like the best I got. <laughs> it's not going to be easy, but it's what I have to do. Um, I might be able to manipulate something this way. Yeah, this would uh, free up some breath attacks as well. So they're not, they're not going to line up down this way. There's no way. They might line up a little bit this way, though. So if I go here, I'd be slightly better. That side is what I'm worried about. That side for you. Oh, by the way, um, Spider already left. Crap, I, w I wish he was here for this, but if you haven't voted for the next LP, the next LP is in the top right-hand corner, so... Go to my card in the top right hand corner and vote for the next LP that you want to see after Norgard is complete. There's four choices. There is New Omikia, um, Carleon, Escalio, and the Empire. So, whatever you want to see, please vote. Thank you. Come again. <laughs> a miss. A fine miss. That'll work. help. Alright, uh, let's see. Get a hit right here. Griffin or Centaur? Probably Griffin. Um, can kill him with this. With at least this attack here. I'm gonna see. Uh, it won't be an exit blast, that's for damn sure. That's too much of a waste. So... guy could get pincered, so, yeah. Oh, no. Did I not change it? Crap. I didn't put it back. Hang on. Can I do it now? Um, maybe. Hang on. Let me see if I can put this in here. One moment. Okay. 
clearly on. Two more choices. Scalio's one, and then the Empire's one. Okay. Is it there now? Let me know. It should be. I'm showing that it's there. So... At least on my dashboard. I'm not seeing it on my actual live feed, but dashboard is there. So, yeah, tell me. Alright, back to it. 2v6. Free attack in here, maybe. Ouch. Okay, cool. Yeah, sorry about that. If uh, if you're not seeing the voting tally right now, um, refresh the page and then go to the top right and make sure it's there. It should be there right now. So, thanks, Mike. I appreciate it, man. So. I'll usually take that card away for indie Sundays, and I, I just forgot to put it back. So. Yep, there's that space. And he's pincered. That's fine. Alright. Let's see. Get a breath attack down this way. Not too bad. Yep, let's go. That's terrible. That's so bad. Um, I can pincer him. Are you still in range of protection? Yes, you are. And heals. So we're good. Okay. Pincer. <laughs> and then kill. I don't even need to do a pre-move, but... Uh, yeah. Don't take chances. <laughs> I know how that works out. Good. Hmm. 81%. Let's see. Did he crit last time? I forget. I can pincer with this Hydra. Then again, I want Garrett to come in here with his dragons. Um... Nah, let's do it like this. This is fine. Aw. Oh, almost. That's okay. He's not gonna move anyway. So I might actually take him out and uh let's see. Replace with the scorpion temporarily. I would like to prevent the dragon from getting pincered. go up here, they can't immediately come in and pincer him, so it's good. So... Yeah, let's do that. So if I kill him with this, I can give somebody Fury if I wanted to, but... It's not the best time. Nah, I want the kill with pa with Palmies. Here we go. Okay. Um. B. 
here, I think. Decent spot, but they can't get into fight Palamedes in that case. Um, that's honestly the best spot, because that's, that's three spaces for Exoblast. And then, um, yeah, the castle's here, breath attacks. It, it may be in my best interest to just to let this be like this, because the breath attack can go here this way too, and then reverse. Huh. I might keep this formation. The only thing I really have to worry about is these big ass dragons coming in here to chop me. But uh, I do have protection and heals, so. Yeah, let's leave it like that. We'll see what happens. Nice block. Good. Good. Alright, Garrett. You are who I'm afraid of the most. He took it. He took the spot. Yep, and I'm gonna miss like crazy. Crap. I might be able to pincer him though. Yeah, he's in a bad spot. If if this Hydra can go, then I'll be able to pincer him. I think he's going next. 17. You are 17. Did you go? You didn't go yet, did you? Nope. I don't think so. Anyway. Um, let's see. Big Matty made it to the stream. What's up, buddy? How you doing? You came in at the last battle, bro. But this is still pretty fresh, so I still have a ways to go. How's your day going, man? Good to see you. I just stuck. Crap. Good to hear you're back up and running at work, man. I'm sure you're feeling great about that. this up, but he is resistant to magic. This isn't going to do crazy amounts of damage, but it'll be decent. But then I have to think about pincering him. I can't remember if uh, Cole went yet, if he took his turn. I can't remember. Did this guy take his turn? Can someone tell me? <laughs> I don't think he did, but please let me know. That's important. Thank you. 
this guy out of the way. If I get him out of the way, then they're going to have to plug in two slots for Garrett not to be uh, inserted. That's all my, that's all my mana. Yeah, that'll take a lot, way too much. I still have a few things I can do, like heal or flame, but it's not too much. Plus, I won't be able to use Exit Blast on him. But he's not in range of heals. This is tricky. Okay. Um. Yeah, kill it. Kill it with fire. Like it. That's right. He's got the uh, the large shield, the five percent increase to shield block. Pretty cool. Okay, they plugged one spot. They still need to plug the bottom spot though. I think I have it. Okay, so definitely do a breath attack down this way. Oh, they're going down. They're going down. They're, they're trapped like crazy here. Look at this. This is nuts. Breath attack, breath attack, another breath attack here. But I'm going to use this Hydra, though, to pincer Garant. But still, yeah. That's what I was wondering about Cole if he took his turn yet. He could have prevented that pincer, but he didn't. So He almost did. He put the gin in one of the pincer spots because I cut the Gryphon off. But yeah. Alright, can we get a good percentage with the pre-move? Yeah, it's decent. It's not too bad. That is like triple white on white on double white though. Um I might be able to kill the gym with the pre-move. Let's see. Or do I need to focus on heals? Um Not necessarily. You're okay. This dragon needs some help, but it has protection. I can switch him out. Um Oh no, I can't, not currently. He might die. Uh, let's see. Let's try to get rid of... Uh... Hmm. I want to do maximum damage, but then again, I want to get this thing weaker. What can he get hit by else? Like, nothing crazy. No. I could do a power breath attack up that way, maybe. Get rid of this guy. But they're not going to leave because of that. Garrett doesn't have any good monsters with him. Let's see. Another toss-up. <laughs> God bless. Alright. Um. Yeah, try this. No! No, 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 no. Oh, man. That's unfortunate. Completely a wasted turn. This didn't, Jin doesn't have anywhere good to go. I'll put you here for now. That's garbage. Alright, this was the plan. I don't know how well it's going to work. Giant can get in here for another hit. I have to move you, though. Then I'll lose the pincer with somebody. That's not good. I can't afford to move. 86%. Mm. It's potentially, you might, potentially, you might get healed by him if he goes first. It's going to suck. Commit. Good. See if I can at least get him poisoned. Yep. 
so much damage on this guy. It's ridiculous. Mm. I wanted to take advantage of the weakness. That percentage is just terrible. All right. They're starting to come back now. <laughs> yeah. Nice hit. Ouch. That sucks. Oh boy. Please let more Hulk go first. Please let him go first. Garrett might retreat, or he might do an IE slash. But yeah. Regardless, I need uh, I need more Hulk to go first. Stayed. He attacked more Holt for whatever reason. I guess they can get me with the Fafnir, but crap, he went first. Yep, there it is. Damn it. That's fine. I still have the options to kill him. I mean, it's not the end of the world, but I could have prevented some casualties. Or some crazy-ass damage in the process as well. Alright. Maybe still get him. We'll see. You're out, so... Go over there. Go play. <laughs> um, sure, we'll pincer her. Why not? I'll be able to get out of there is the question. Hmm. Let's do this first. Nice crit. It honestly doesn't matter if I can get out of here or not. No one's going to go here. It's physical. So yeah, do what you do. Might die. Close. He can get out. Oh, lucky you. Lucky you. Alright. Um, he might cut away this arrow. So, let's use you for something different. And then instead, make sure that Palomides gets the kill. Yep. That's the plan. Alright, so you can do... Probably just do a Venom. But there really there's no reason not to do anything else but a flame, really. Yeah, let's just do a flame. Good. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's keep hitting her, probably. Or this guy. Um, hmm. I could try to kill her and capture this, but killing this thing might be better. It could die from the Hydra, another breath attack down this way, and maybe a pre-move if it hits. Let's try to kill the uh, Gold Dragon. Nice crit. Okay. It's something. Alright, two different ways I can do this. With you or with you. You are pretty much dead. Let's see. It's going to be with you, Palamides. So. Yep. Goodbye. Oh boy. Level 15. Two dragons didn't escape. And a centaur. What level are they? Now they're just one, but that's good replacers. Excellent. Excellent. Alright. Things are looking up. Um, you are not looking up so much. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're probably gonna die. I can't... 
I can't make you escape, so probably just breath attack up this way, do some more damage, get the weakness off. So, yep. Breath attack it is. Boom. This was a tough one to uh, strategize on, but I think the best call was to let them come in three in a row on that front line there, leaving just those three spaces open to attack my leaders, because they took it. They took it like champs. Like, they're weakened a little bit, but they're sitting pretty after Geraint is gone, so... Yeah, not too bad. Alright, she'll definitely kill him if I hit her. Um, then again, do I let her live? Um, let's see. I can't hit you with anything else. Let's see. Sure. Oh, I was hoping for a stun. That's alright. I've got dragons to replace, so no big deal. Uh, let's see. Yep, this is happening. <laughs> Try to get this dragon dead. Should have done my acid breath first, didn't even think about it. Oh well. Killed my own gin. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, well, stupid me. It's fine. It's a kill. Nice. Gold Dragon's dead. And there's a Tiamat. <laughs> Alright. see. They're definitely not staying after this. Do I get a kill or do I heal? I don't really need a heal, really. Maybe on this guy. Yeah, we'll kill. Good. Thank you, sir. I definitely lost some in the process, but this team is um, sort of a lackluster team at the current time. It's decent, but yeah. The average teams are going to take, take some hits, so it's all right. Be able to kill him. Let's see. Do you have any MP left for a Fury? Nope. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. You are spent. He got away. <laughs> Lucky you. Alright. Good job. That was not too bad. Took a few losses, but I gained three monsters out of it. Two dragons. Plus, there's a team mod that's coming up. Yeah. I'm satisfied. Cool. And there's the second attack I was going to do. Okay. This battle's not happening today. <laughs> I'm already at an hour and a half. And it's time to quit. So, but in any case, it's been a great stream. So, let's go ahead and plop down and save her up. And then we will continue this on Tuesday next week. So. Excellent. This team is going to go down very quickly. <clears throat> I can feel it. We have a lot of good stuff up here. Three really powerful leaders. And then, uh,. A white dragon. Yes, sir. Cool. All right. Save. We will quit. Thank you, everybody, so much for joining me for today. It's been quite the pleasure. And uh, hopefully we'll see you soon on the multiplayer. So if you don't know about the multiplayer yet, I'm currently doing a multiplayer with Trigger, Frost PDP, and Raging Paul. So we're going to do the 2v2 um, playthrough of Brigandine. It's going to be me as Kaleon and then... Um, teaming up with Raging Paul as Norgard, 
and then we're going against uh, Veracity Trigger as the Empire and Frost PDP as a Scalio. So 2v2, if you want to catch some of that, it's going to be every Sunday around, I think, like 9 p.m., 10 p.m. ish Eastern Standard Time. Cool. All right, other than that, if you want to follow me in any of my social media websites, they are downstairs, downstairs, down in the description with Discord, Patreon, Twitter, and Twitch. All four of those are down there if you want to follow me and keep in touch with updates. And definitely hit that like button. Do not forget. It really helps out the channel. And consider sub, subbing. Subbing, subbing. Can't speak. If this is your first time here. All right, guys. Thank you to all my regulars and all the new people. I will see you on Tuesday for more Brigandine. I'm your host, Valkasinari. Stay well, Lenarians. Peace.